what is everybody's love affair with Trembolone? And I tried it years ago as well when it was called Finiject. It is a dangerous drug. I saw a teenager win a teenage contest where the kid looked good if he was natural. When I found out that he was using 40 mils a week, I was kind of disgusted. I don't think I, he knew what he was doing to his health. Like Chris Bumstead, he made a choice and that is a drug that he's not going to use again. I don't understand the excessive dosages. Maybe it's fake because if you're taking 40 or 50 milligrams of that stuff a week and you still look like a good teenage competitor, it either didn't work and you should get your money back or there's something terribly wrong. And what I get told by a lot of the people that use it is that it sends their sex drive through the roof. With me, it was the exact opposite. When I stopped hair loss, a lack of libido and not feeling the best. The way it's made is very suspect. In France, it may still be available. It's a long acting Trembolone and it's called Parabola. I did use that. I used fast-acting Trembolone but nothing like what everybody talks about. I actually don't know 100% what is in Trembolone. I know what's supposed to be in there. I know the chemical name of it but you really don't know. The name Tren means there may be three different compounds in there. It is a non-aromatizing androgen. It's made for animals but having said that you know there are some racehorses out there that are worth millions of dollars and some humans that take that are not worth that much. If I was doing a drug cycle, that is not a drug that I'd be putting in.